This is some of the best defense in Madden 24. Not only does it have really, really good coverage, man. As y'all can see, it's going to consistently get you pressure. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to that notification bell. And let's go ahead and get into this game, boys. It's your boy, back to you again with another video. And today, you guys, I got some more heat, man. We are currently in the Stillest Playbook, man. And we are going to be working out of the 2-4. I'm going to be showing y'all blitz and also a good zone coverage that y'all can go ahead and make. Saying, first thing that y'all actually want to go ahead and do, boys, you want to make sure you have some good safeties or some pretty decent safeties right here. It doesn't really matter if faster than linebackers. Make sure that they are faster than linebackers because they will get animations and things like that. The next thing you want to go ahead and do, boys, you want to go ahead and put your zone coverage on match. So the play that we're going to be utilizing in today's video is going to be this cover four quarters, boys. Uh, we are just going to be working this against random deep pass. So first thing that you actually want to do with this play is base align. Uh, you don't even have to use or anybody. What I typically do is just quarterback contain. Uh, I'll show you all another abbreviation in set two if you want to throw some extra coverage out there. But as you can see, for the most part, the coverage is going to be locked down. I think that time around they actually lost about two yards. So let's go ahead and set it up. Base line, quarterback contain. This is basically going to be the setup. You want to have safeties right here, uh, which kill killer. Oh, dang, that's a that's a hell of a last name. But um, he's supposed to be a safety, but I think this is a middle linebacker. So I don't know why he doesn't sub out. But you want to make sure that you have your safeties right there because they are just going to get into those places a lot easier. As y'all can see, everything is locked up. Everything is covered pretty well. Uh, base along, quarterback contained. That's basically the only setup that you need to do, boys. Uh, just like this. Uh, then you kind of just pass rush yourself. Now, another thing that you can go ahead and do if you want to, uh, you could quarterback contain base along how, like how we were doing before and throw your fastest DM right here where you have Hayward. And what you can go ahead and do. Uh, just go ahead and engage with the offensive line and then just run back out if you want to do a little bit more extra coverage out there. Uh, but as y'all can see, this coverage is just really lights out. Nothing is really getting thrown on us. It does a pretty good job against the uh, run as well, uh, against run formation. So that's a good thing too. But uh, for the most part, it's going to lock everything up. As y'all can see, that boy Porter Jr., man, uh, his dad was one of my favorite players, man. Miami Dolphin player right there. But... Now, boys, I'm going to show y'all the blitz abbreviation of this thing. So, y'all seen this concept of the coverage. I'll show y'all one more time. Just base line and quarterback contain. Nothing too crazy here. If you want to throw some coverage out there, just put your fast D-line. Uh, D-lineman right there. Engage for a second just to kind of bring in a little bit more pressure and run back out. And as y'all can see, those quarterback contains kind of get glitchy off the edge as well. So, the blitz concept, what you want to go ahead and do, boys, you want to blitz all linebackers just like this. And what you want to go ahead and do, you want to press. And once you press, you see how these linebackers actually come down. Uh, then you want to play underneath and you want to play over the top. You do that by pressing triangle, right stick down, press triangle again, right stick up. Uh, you want to make sure, like I was saying, have safeties in these spots. So, you want to go ahead and engage. And then you just want to go back out in coverage. Uh, that's how we just got burnt. We just get like we just got burned. I'm not gonna lie to y'all boys right there. That's not gonna happen if you have some pretty decent cornerbacks. That's why we play over the top. So we're gonna go ahead and reset the play. So right here, right here in this situation, you're gonna have to kind of baseline. This time we can't really set it up because it's not really our linebackers. We just gonna have to let this one play out. So kind of just let this one play out. Then I'm gonna show y'all the blitz one more time, uh, really quick. So hopefully the computer hikes it real quick. Okay, just let them do what they fit to do. As y'all can see, match concept is it, just going to be money every single time for the most part in coverage. Uh, but the blitz abbreviation of it, you want to just blitz all linebackers like this. You want to press, keep pressing until you, both of your linebackers are down the gap. You want to play underneath and you want to play over, to, over the top. You want to take um, your middle linebacker right here and you want to go ahead and engage. Uh, with the old lineman first if you feel like you can get to the quarterback go ahead and just run towards the quarterback But you want to go ahead and engage first With the old lineman once they actually hike it and then if you are able to run back out in coverage And for the most part it's gonna have enough uh, that time All right now They kind of clicking us a little bit So I ride this right out the pocket, but for the most part this blitz is gonna get in It's kind of one of those things you want to mix in but it works a lot better 
where you're actually working it against a person as well too it's just that the computer is kind of clicking us but for the most part it's going to get an instant just like that uh, your opponent isn't going to have too much time when it comes to this blitz so it's just another thing that you can go ahead and just mix in uh, go ahead and base the line another thing what you can go ahead and do too boys if you really want to like send some heavy blitzes uh, out of this as well I'm going to go ahead and let, this, let them run this out because um, anytime you can't get this linebacker down this gap, the blitz isn't going to work anyway. So I'm just going to go ahead and let this thing run out. How um, Once the computer actually hikes the ball. So as y'all can see, the computer going to do their thing. Just let Tyrod run real quick. Oh my Jesus. Y'all just see what Tyrod just did to us. So what you want to go ahead and do, if that isn't working from a pressure standpoint, just do what we were doing before. Uh, just like this. And if you want to send extra, extra pressure bring this guy right here down and basically you can't gauge it and just go back out in coverage as well uh, this is just in case you the first blitz doesn't get in initially uh, as you can see it gets in that time around so it's just another abbreviation to kind of throw in and make same with this uh, blitz if this version isn't working for you uh, because it's just gonna make another old line and just kind of engage with you for a split second and you just want to go right back out in coverage and just like that uh, they cut us that time around but that's the risk that you run when you are blitz and so uh, boys you got that nice blitz variation of everything uh, that you can go ahead and run uh, then you also got this coverage version that you can go ahead and run out of this formation man so uh, cover four quarters it's a pretty powerful formation man if you know how to utilize it with the match concept and everything uh, it works pretty good also, if you want to just like do a different look or something like that, you can also always fool your opponent by kind of giving him that that kind of coverage look that you were giving him before and kind of just press and play over the top and kind of just use it with this guy a little bit too just to give your opponent a different look uh, overall. So as you can see, kind of giving us a different look this time around and we are still consistently getting pressure. Uh, but boys, if you enjoyed this content, make sure to hit a like, subscribe to the channel, man. Click that notification bell to stay up to date with all of my videos. Y'all been wanting me to drop some more defensive videos, so that's what I've been doing. I haven't been dropping any defensive videos this year, uh, but this is the second one now. So y'all make sure to tap in. But it's your boy Lurk, man. I love y'all, boys. Y'all stay up. Y'all stay blessed. I will catch y'all in the next video. And peace.